Hi everyone, welcome to Apple Tech page. In this tutorial, I will show you how to fix iPhone keeps popping up. Your career may charge for SMS message used to activate iMessage and FaceTime error. Solution 1 is remove the SIM card and reinsert it. Before removing the SIM card, you have to turn off your iPhone. To do this, go to settings app. Scroll down and tap on general. Again scroll down the screen to bottom and tap shutdown. Now drag the power off slider to right side to turn off your iPhone. Once you turned off, remove the SIM card. Then wait for a few seconds and reinsert it. Now turn on your iPhone by pressing the power button until you see the Apple logo. Solution 2 is sign out of iMessage and FaceTime. First, go to Settings app. Next, find and tap on Messages. Here, tap on Send and Receive. Now, tap on your Apple ID, then tap Sign Out in the pop up window to confirm this process. Go back and tap on FaceTime. Tap on your Apple ID and tap Sign Out. Solution 3 is make sure that date and time are set correctly. To check that, go to settings app. Next, tap on general. Now tap on date and time. Make sure that set automatically is turned on. If it's turned on already, then turn off and on it. Solution 4 is reset network settings. This process deletes your Wi-Fi networks and passwords, APN and VPN settings and cellular settings. Launch settings app. Tap on general. Scroll down to bottom and tap reset. Here tap on reset network settings. Next you will be prompted to enter your iPhone's passcode. Tap Reset Network Settings in the pop-up window to confirm this process. Solution 5 is Update your iPhone to the latest version of iOS. Make sure that your iPhone is connected to Wi-Fi, then launch Settings app. Find and tap on General. Next, tap on Software Update. Tap Download and Install if update is available. Solution 6 is change your Apple ID password. To do this, go to settings app. Now tap on your Apple ID name. Here tap on password and security. Now tap on change password. Enter your current Apple ID password if required. Then enter a new password and confirm that password. Once done, tap change in the top right corner. Thanks for watching. Do like, share and subscribe to Apple Tech page.